Good afternoon. This is the 411. I'm Sherman Chow. And I'm Lynn Ken. And we have got breaking news to tell you about out of Bryan, Texas. That's about 90 miles northwest of Houston. There are reports of multiple people injured after a shooting. You can see that's a live shot. Bryan police are confirming there was a shooting. That scene located along FM 2818 and Stone City Drive, if you're familiar with the Bryan area. Air 11 is heading to the scene. We're working this story to get you more information. Rusty Surrett from our CBS station in Bryan has an update. Hey everybody, Rusty Surrett here. Wanted to give you an update on the active shooter situation that uh, happened here in Bryan. We're now getting confirmation from Bryan police that multiple people were shot at 350 Stone City Drive about an hour ago here on the northwest side of town. This is 2818 Harvey Mitchell here behind me. Uh, we're right across from Jane Long School, which has just lifted its lockdown. Police saying again, multiple people injured in a shooting incident this afternoon. Sources have told me that six people were shot. There are a few of those victims who are in critical condition. And at this point, there is not a suspect in custody. So that is the very latest. We're about to move a little bit closer to where the shooting actually happened. So stay with KBTX, the KBTX social media platforms will get you the very latest. But at this point, multiple people shot at uh, 350 Stone City drive which comes back to Kent Moore cabinets and um, uh, several people in critical condition and a suspect not in custody at this point no description on the suspect we're gonna move a little bit closer we'll keep you posted on the very latest stay tuned All right, so based on that report it sounds like the shooting took place at some sort of cabinet business you heard Rusty Surrett saying that sources are telling him a total of six people have been shot there as soon as we get more updates from what's going on in Bryan Texas uh, we will have it on air online at khou.com and of course our free KHU 11 mobile app where you can get push alerts.